And we're going to start off here with a little bit of a breaking news thing. Came out this morning. Ian Rappaport of the NFL reports that five players are suspended in the NFL due to gambling infractions, uh, the most notable being Jameson Williams, Quintus Cephas being the other one, um, and then a couple other players. Basically, what happened, at least for Jameson Williams, is suspended six games. Um, the other uh, Three of the other ones are suspended for an entire year, but Williams in particular was suspended for betting on college football games, which is technically allowed, it says, but they did so at a team facility, which means that isn't allowed. So, I don't know. What are your thoughts on that? Does it clarify? Does the report clarify what the other players were betting on? It, I don't, mm, yes, okay. The three players who were suspended for a year all bet on NFL games. Okay, so that makes sense. To me, that makes sense. If you're going to bet on an NFL game, you should be gone the full year. If you're betting on anything other than the NFL, leave these guys the fuck alone. I, I agree. agree. Right? I mean, there's just no sense. I mean, let, let them be. Yeah, like, I mean, if a guy wants to throw money on, like, a PGA event or sure. something like that or an NBA game, like, I don't see what's wrong with that. But the NFL, 100%. That's a no-no. Like, you, you can't do that? Yeah, of course. I mean, and that makes sense. Like, right. That's where they draw the line, Calvin Ridley. Now, these guys, if you bet on the NFL and you're in the NFL, you're done. And, like, I don't – what what's what's wrong with placing a bet at the facility? I don't get that. Like, it's not like you're getting inside information at right. the lines. It's not like you're in the Celtics facility no. betting on Tatum to be out for the game when you know he's going to be out. So it's not like that. And it, you know what? It also feels like – I don't know if they knew the rules. It also feels like – they are, yeah, they're like, all right, we're going to throw a bet down, whatever, college football, basketball. You're, you're literally just screwing around. You're, they, just, you're just, like, having some fun and it's, placing a bet. It like, seems like it's almost like a loophole to catch these players because, like, yeah. why would that be illegal? Why would that be against a – I don't get it. Um, I think we're all on the same page here that it's ridiculous. Uh, NFL needs to, you know, you got to figure something out because you don't want to see Jamison Williams. He, just, he was out for basically the whole year, comes back. Yep. He's supposed to be one of the most promising receivers in the league, especially with the Lions, who have been one of the most promising teams in the league. And now you're going to go out there and suspend him for six games for this? Yeah, I mean, you want to see him, him on the field. Yeah. Him, like Jamison Williams should get no suspension. That's so stupid. The other Great. guys, like, you're an idiot for doing that. Yes. You're just an idiot. And that's exactly right. Um, because Jamison Williams is such a – he's such a – Promising names, like yeah, they just drafted him. Yeah, exactly. The Lions had such a good year last year. They need this guy going forward, and now they're going to be losing him. It's going to be a tough beat. Not only know? that, I mean, if you're the NFL, you want to see your playmakers on the field. One hundred percent. If this was Mahomes, I guarantee, especially you'd be under the rug, because like, why would you want him not playing? Well, the game? honestly, like, I don't know if they would swept under the rug. Who knows? But but I mean, at the same time, it's a really stupid suspension for Williams to get. Yeah, it's like, I'm not a fan. Doesn't make sense to me. Um, but as you were just saying, you guys were kind of hinting at it there. It's a promising team with a big turnaround, a market that people want to see start winning. It's a likable team. Um, so, yeah, I mean, it's unfortunate, and it's just a stupid suspension. Agreed.